All right, good evening, everyone. Welcome to the Kutamaran Shir. We just counted 47 days ago. So we are, you know, getting into Yemei Akbala. And uh, maybe it would behoove us to, to, to speak a little bit. <clears throat> Maybe we can do it on uh, the Shabbos. Talk a little more about uh, Shavuos. But let's let's dive into it. So basically, we're saying that the order is that there are Makifin, or Chafalof, we are in the middle of Sintes, I believe, yeah. So we said that there are two sikhlim, there is sikhal pnimi, there's makif, and the sikhal, the, the, the name of the game is to bring in the makif into sikhal pnimi. When you do this, you get a new makif, and to bring that into sikhal pnimi. A radio calls it in different names and different terror. Different terrors. There's one terror in which he calls it Torah and Tfila. You know, that that the Torah is the Pnimi and the Tfila is the Maki. There's another terror Rabbi says that this is the Hina of Nasa the Mishma. Nasa is the Pnimi. This is what you can do. And Nishma is that which is beyond you. That's the Maki. So we basically said that there is makif, and sometimes the makif is stuck. It's stuck in, in the barrel, as it were, and it doesn't come out. At that particular time, what you need to do is to cry out in turn in order you know, to release the makif from being totally concealed and unreachable into a state of market. Once in a state of market, you work on the seven candles and you bring it in. And with this, you capture a seichel, which is pchinas ruach kiddush, which is ruach that comes from kiddush. This is seichel loki. It's not a seichel pchinas. Oh, it's pchinas seichel pchinas kenim. So now we will talk about these two kinds of makifim. This is the meaning of the fourth chapter, the Sifra that's Nusa. This is what it means in the Sifra that's the fourth chapter of its Nusa that we said in the beginning. Atiko, the level of Atiko is Tommy Vesasi. It is concealed and it's unfathomable. Seira de Anpin, the level of Seira de Anpin, that is the lower level, is Galia or the lowest Galia. It is revealed and it isn't revealed. In other words, sometimes it reveals, sometimes it's not revealed. I will explain. Atiko Zephinata Maki. Atiko. There is, of course, the the the, the Atika Kadisha of the Indian of the, the all the Olimus and so forth and so on. But over here we're looking at at, at uh, um, any kind of 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 of, of makif is called Pinus Atika. We said in the Ois Dalad that that the makifim of Atiko, those makifim that euphemistically are called Atiko, 
is tremendously great seichel that the brain, the human brain, the human intellect cannot possibly contain it. Very has bemos, and it doesn't get into the mind. It surrounds the head. And a person is not can, is not capable of understanding it in this world. In other words, it's a level of intelligence that is beyond this world. There was Shehen, Tmirim, Ususumi, Nikoltan. That level of Makifim, that kind of Makifim are totally concealed, totally sealed from every side. The entire length of time of this world. These makifim cannot be revealed, cannot be understood. It will, only, it will not be revealed except in the future. However, in the level of Zerampin, this is already this is already the level of the Chochmah of a person. That the person is capable of reaching it. Gambahem, even in the level of Zerampin, you don't understand everything. Gambahem Yashkin, that is, there is a level of the Sechel that already went into your mental faculties, into your intelligence, and you are able to process it and you understand it, and you know it well. Vamakit. There's a level in, in Zerab, in which is, is the Makif. That's the Seichel that surrounds your Seichel. And it still didn't get in. So you don't really understand it. You don't, you don't, you don't get around. And every person, according to his Bechino, is Lachino or Makif. Every person has, as we said before, many times, every person has Kino and Makif. The Eilu Amevuchos and these conundrums. She have sala ishala sechalod and lasigon that is not possible for human mind to attain. Miprina satiko, they stem from the inner fatiko and the in the upper realms. You know that we have in the upper realms these five personas, and the highest. Is 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 Ati. It's called Sphere Sakesar. The Kola Chok Mishikola Moach Ainushil Asigotan. All the wisdoms, all the intelligence that it is in within the human power to understand. They all originate from the level of Zir Dampin in the upper world. This, out of the, the, the five parts of him, if you remember, we have Patika, which is, as we say, like the grandfather. Then we have the father and the mother, which is Chochman and Bina. Then you have the sixth Sefirot from Chesed, Murat, Tiferes, Natsachod, Yisod. This is Zerampin. This is the son. Then there's the Malchus, is the daughter. So there aren't been all the, the, the intelligence, all the, the wisdom that it is impossible to grasp as long as time exists. In other words, in this world, this comes from Atiko Kadisha. That's the level of the castle. However, the level that is humanly reachable You have a Sechel Pnimin, you have a Sechel Makif. In that, it all comes from the level of Ze'er Anpin. Ze'er Anpin is, is the, the level that, that, that presents uh, cognizance, awareness. The Malchut represents the Emunah, and Ze'er Anpin represents the Das, represents the knowing. The moment. So it has sometimes a certain things that you can understand, certain things that you don't understand yet. 
יש פנימיין מאקו. לפעמים הם באלם, sometimes they're not keeping off, זה רנפין, הקונסילד, פס איבור, וזה בחינה, this is what the ספר יציר, I'm sorry, the, 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 ספר דצנימי שסייז, the day happens sometimes is knowable and sometimes is not knowable, sometimes it is reachable sometimes is not reachable. So lefamim and be'elim, lepchinas ibon. This is when it's stuck, as it were. Zeh pchinas lo isgalia, that's what we're saying. Zeh rampin sometimes isgalia, sometimes not isgalia. That's isgalia is talking about when the notion is the ibon. It's not revealed. Ukshin is galaloi, and when it is revealed to you because you cried out, you cried to Kodesh Baruch to help you, as Bishon is Galio, then it is in the level of is Galio. Then it's revealed to you. And then what is it then? Then it becomes Makif. Beforehand, it wasn't even a Makif yet. Because it was unfathomable, it was, it was the evil. It was in a state of pregnancy, in a way. When it gives birth, when it gave birth, When the Eber is over, then it becomes market, which means now you have to work on the seven candles to sanctify the seven candles and not to bring it in. And in the whole month, Shalagavaz of Chinas Lois Galio, and as long as that matter was by you in the state of Lois Galio, it's un- unrevealed yet, the Chinas Elen. Of concealment, what's like more segul? By you, it was like something which is a segul, something which is it's 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 something that helps for something else, but there's no uh, understandable reason why it helps for that. So the malam is sichlon. It's like the something which is which is good for something, a segul for something, that you have no idea why is this working for that? Why is segul for parnasa? Why it helps parnasa? Also for and so on. This image, so that seichel, when it's pchinas nelam, it is bchinas sgula. Lachar kach shenis galaloi. Then when it's revealed to you, as eighty mitubah lachilim, then you can reveal it to others. So altogether, we are, we explain the person cries out to Kadosh Baruch Hu. He takes out the Shefa Eloki from a state of pregnancy to a state of Maki. And when a person sanctifies the seven candles, his mouth, his nose, his eyes, and his ears, he's zeichet to bring the Makif into his mind, the Shefa Eloki. And from Pchinas Makif, it becomes Pini. And, 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 and when that happens, When you are bringing a Shefa Eloki from Makif to Pnimi, then your heart burns to HaKadosh Baruch Hu all the time. And you are to new Diburim to HaKadosh Baruch at all times. And these Diburim are not just because there's a Pnimi Sohah HaKadosh Baruch Hu. So, why now Rabbein is going to get in to see if you doubt when When, when he's actually going to say that when a person is zoichel to get the Shefa Eloki, the divine bounty from Ibor to Makif, step one, and from Makif to Pnimi, step two, he's zoichel to Das. Now, this is a very special Das. That means that you understand things. But until now, you could not understand. And this das is a nechama and consolation for all the terms. Obviously, it's something that we need to understand now. And this is what it says, nachamu, nachamu, ami, 
in the end of the of the of the Golos, the Shabbos will tell the the Nevi'im that they should console Amisro because all their virus, all their sins were atoned, and it's their time to be redeemed. Let us show the program in. And what's read, written in this particular pasuk that that there is even though we are still in Golas, there is a certain level that where there is a bechina of consolation on all the suffering that we go through. And this is what I've been saying. Call that source by Surah Golas, all the troubles and the suffering and the Golas. It's only commensurately with how much a person does not know, does not get it. When that das is completed, when that das is completed, then all of his friends are fulfilled. As Chaval said, if das can you tell me if you manage to recur the das, then you don't lack anything. As I said, Lachen, the Pasuk says, Lachen Gola Ami, this is why my people were exiled me be das, because they have no das. He says that the exile is a state of mind. It is, it becomes when a person does not understand that 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 the Kosbah is everywhere, everything that goes with us, everything that, that happens to us. Is Kula Lakus, Kula Kurdish Kula too. That is Prinas Golos. That is exile. Now, when in right now, when we are in Golos, the thing that, that helps us is a Muna. So a Muna is something that you're a and the stronger you're a Muna, you know the more easy and possible it is for you to overcome and, and the, the, understand the rigors of the Tsaras, the Yisur. But when a person has a Das, when a person is a Hanat, it goes above the Emunah, into the level of Das, and he knows why this happened, then this is this is already this is already the das completes to a person all that he lacks and all the church. Now Rabbeinu takes it one step further. Not only will the das console us completely, Rabbeinu says, eternal life. Yellow it will be the state of affairs in the future, because we will have such an abundance of das, everybody will know HaKadosh Baruch And then he says, das, and it is through that das, they will become one with the oneness of HaKadosh Baruch Everybody will live eternal life like the Lord. Because by knowing, by having the knowledge, by no understanding, you become one of the Lord. As the Chokhem said, If I would have known the Lord, I would have been a Lord. The Kaddish Baruch and the Chokhmah is one thing. It's a very, very, very profound concept. If I would know a Kaddish Baruch, I would be part of it. Because a person can only be massive, can only fathom something which resembles him in his table and his mahus. The main idea will be in the future. The land will be filled with knowledge of Hashem. Also, we know that the of knowledge is a connection, it's a hero. It says, the other, the other, they became one thing. 
when you know something, you and that which you know become one thing, one separate. So when you know Hakadosh Baruch Hu, you are part of Him. So the main idea will be in the future. Because of that level of cognizance, this level of understanding that we will achieve in the future, you won't like anything. Everything will be good. What? Today, now, because Baruch is not one. It says, What? Now is not one. Now is also one. And then we said that here too, on the good news, we make a tovanetu. While laying on bad news, we make the MS. And also, however, for the future, kula tovanetu is totally just a tovanetu. There is no Rashi says there is no such thing as bad tidings, bad news. This is an important thing to understand and to realize. As you well know, things are rolling out in our lives uh, that baffle the moon. A black believer we've experienced uh, an astonishing event of the 45 Tzadikim that perished right outside the cave of Hashem Malachim. And immediately, immediately, we see now that we, there is, or there was, still is, but definitely was, unbelievable judgments in the world. We can see now. I want to tell you a story that I heard from Rabshin Taichin. Now, everybody knows what happened in 1967. You know, Six Day War. But in 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 Elo. Of, of the previous year, 1966. Uh, there was uh, a trip that one of the yeshivas took uh, to Kibbutz Tzadikim. Now, in those days, they didn't travel by bus, you know, when you go, you went to the, on a trip. They used to travel on trucks. The trucks had, you know, the, the back end of the truck, they were like, you know, benches, four benches on the side of the truck. That's how you travel. And they went, went to Meron, they went to Tzfaz. And so it happened that Lolayu, coming down the roads from Tzfaz, the truck, Lolayu turned over and fell into the uh, uh, gorge, whatever it was, and many, many people uh, were hurt, badly hit, and two Bahrain, uh were killed. And the world of yeshivas was stunned. How can it be an Elo? You know, they went to Kibitz Abikim, to Daven, kind of Klal Israel. What was going on was that Am Israel was in tremendous terror. You know, all the Arab nations, you know, congregated to start a war with, with Am Israel. 
Um, and there was, the situation was extremely frightening. And then, there you go on, 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 on the elo of the, the year before. You know, this kind of, of, of disaster happened. And this is a mice that is very well known within the world of yeshivas. That one of the Bachram that were killed, Hedah Chabrusim, that learned with him for many years. I mean, since they were kids, I mean, he is a Yeshiva Bachram. And they were learning together, Yeshiva they learned together. They're very, very good Bachram, very, very fast friends. And, and, and so sometimes later, that, now that, that Bachram, that, that, that friend was inconsolable. He could not, he could not get over the death of his friend, of his halusa. And um, the, the, um, he said that a couple of months later, his halusa came to him in a dream. And he told him two things. The one thing that his followers had told him that passed away, that told him that's the lesson news. He told him, don't, don't, you know, don't be too, you know, don't mourn so hard. He says, he told him that he, he was that he he was killed as a kapara of Klal Israel with big judgments of Israel. And for that reason, this is why he and the other, the other uh, passed away. He says, but the real reason that I came to you now is not that. That's sad that you should, should know that, a, that, that, that he said that he said he was a kapara, it was a carbon. And, and he said, however, I want to tell you when I came to, to Adamus Yainun, he said he was greeted by all the tzaddikim, all the tamnaim, all the maraim, all the rishonim, all the achraim, all those that you learn that time. Now he said, he and his chavrusa, so do you remember when we used to learn Rashi, every once in a while Rashi uses uh, uh, a French word, Yiddish word, a French word, so these things, they, they sort of skipped over. I mean, it was important to them to know that it's known in French like this, it's called like that. I mean, so that's, so he said, I saw everybody and I saw Rashi. And he said, and I saw, I mean, I recognized him. And I saw, I mean, I know who he was. And I saw that he wasn't very happy with me. So I asked him, you know, why, why, why are you not happy with me? So Rashi told him, you remember when you learned, whenever you learned in my parish and you got to uh, 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 a foreign language in, in, my, in my parish, you skipped over it. You're wrong. This Mesa becomes very, very famous because it was a, uh, an unbelievable focus on the tremendous kedusha of Peter Rashi. If Rashi seems, you know, Rashi finds it necessary to write a word in French, you need to learn it. How many times when you learn Rashi on the Chumash, Rashi breaks down the 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 grammar, and he gives all kinds of of of, sam of examples. Why it's written like this? Why it's written like this? In different places, it says like this, and so and so on. And it's hard to understand why is he saying that. 
If Rashi says that that's Kurdish Kadosh, and it needs to be known. I think that even though we don't know, we have absolutely no idea of what Black Bone is all about. I think that it is easier for us now to understand that A, there are momentous judgments, and not necessarily at this point in time. Not just what happens in Gaza, but what's also what happens with the Arabs inside Israel. The Arabs in Israel are revolting. It's not a small thing. So it is easier, it's easier for us to accept and understand and believe that this unexplainable event in Lagba Ibrahim is a particular Indian that Kodesh Baruch Hu did, Hashem Baruchai did, and it is a token amelioration of judgments beyond any comprehension. It's much easier now to grasp that. Until now, even Moch Hashem, we have in the moon of it, Vadek, Tzadik, Yashar, Hashem, Rochel, everything is still, you know, the heart was heavy. Why? Yeah. We still don't know why. But we already have an inkling that it was a refuah that we cannot comprehend to a marker that we cannot comprehend. And we should all daven for Claudius. Uh, and, and every day, every day, es tzorol yakum. This is a very, very serious point. What the Goyans say around the world, they will say the same thing. It's the same cat and dog fight in the backyard. The Goyans will always say the same thing. The anti-Semitism that's going on outside is way beyond. You know, this, this Biden, I mean, it's a mullet. The moment. Because well, who knows what he's doing. So, Nachamu, Nachamu, Ami. Yomar Lateichem. Bezrat Hashem, we are stepping towards Shavuos, towards the captain. Shavuos HaShah HaMishim. The Kesar is Atik HaKadishim, which is unknowable. And this is where we see the term. Bezrat HaShem, Kodesh Baruch Hu, Bezrat HaShem Shul, Bimenachem, Yiklal Yisrael, each and every one of us. I mean, you just take a look. These 45 people that perished, they represent, as I said, we said before many times, they represented every single segment of Torah jewelry. Everyone. Hasidim, Misnagdim, Sfardim, Mishkenazim, 
Chabad to to Satmer, all the way through. Breslov, almost a million Breslovers. And they came from all the Jewish centers, great Jewish centers in the world, from America, from Canada, from England, from Argentina, from everywhere. Because Rojo picked up, and now when, when you find more about these people, you see these amazing tzaddikim, one after the other. One after the other, children, Bachrim, etc. They were picked out one by one. This is with tweezers. There are all kinds of, of stories that are only coming out now. How people that were in totally hopeless situation in that place were saved miraculously. Why? Because they were not the ones to be chosen. should inject us with a Munish Lehman, a Yiddish Lehman. And Zot Hashem will be zechut to be mekadosh ourselves. The Kedusha Siva Tzanir. It's probably going to cry to Kedush Baruch to take it out from Ibor to Makif and sanctify ourselves. Be zechut to bring Makif from inside. Be zechut to nachem nachem and be a nachama. On top of the Muhammad Hashem will continue with this next week. Um, 